Hey guys, my name is Ravish and welcome back to another video in the series of Let's Talk DevOps. And in today's video, we are going to talk about very interesting topic today. And this is on my personal basis that I'll talk about my uh, daily routine as a DevOps engineer. Okay, so I'll discuss everything that I do on a daily basis. So guys, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that I do on a daily basis is uh, generally uh, I wake up at around 8 o'clock, 8.30 uh, at that time and I start my day somewhere around 10 o'clock uh, in, uh, in the morning. And then the first thing that I do is check my calendar. The first thing uh, has, to, has to be taken care of is how many meetings that I have in a day. So uh, sometimes a typical day do, looks like 3 to 4 meetings but sometimes I do have a no meeting day like a Friday or a Monday and timing uh, depends on what kind of a meeting it is so for example if the meeting is some kind of a scrum then uh, it should be like more than not more than 15 to 20 minutes if it's some kind of a kt kt is a uh, knowledge transfer then uh, it should not be more than uh, 30 to 60 minutes and uh, if someone needs any kind of help uh, then it can be on a hoc basis uh, and if it's a project call then it might not take more than uh, 30 to 60 minutes and uh, when I talk about the project call, it means that sometimes we create a roadmap. So uh, when we create a roadmap, so it is something like 30 minutes, uh, uh, 60 minutes, because we have to talk about uh, the things that are we, going to, we are going to do for like one month, two months or, or over the course of six months that can take up to time. So this generally take one to two hours of my daily time or maybe less than that, uh, kind of pretty much uh, a bit of it. So uh, that's the first thing that I do. The second thing uh, that I do is I sit check my slack messages so what exactly is a slack slack is a messaging app and it's kind of a when someone uh, asks you uh, he cannot mail or he want don't want to take a pain of uh, having uh, sending a mail then he generally sends their statuses on slack and there is one more app known as teams it's, it's a microsoft product it's uh, also some kind of a messaging app in which you can tell the status you can talk to someone you can even video call someone or just an audio call and send uh, the messages that what what has been happening so why do i check it because uh, if there is a client and he has sent something over the if, if it's in us and there is a timing difference time zone di time zone difference then he might be sending me some message when i'm when i'm asleep so in the morning uh, i wake up and check those messages and if anything that needs to be done i'll take care of that so that's one thing Another thing we use Slack and Teams because we have integration of our pipelines with these two apps. So if there is any failure in the app, then we have to take care of it and then we have to plan uh, our day accordingly. So uh, this is something uh, that I that I do. So for an example, let's say if there is a, a build failure, then I have to check what kind of a build failure it is. So one thing is, uh, let's say if it's a test case has been failed, then I have to check what kind of a test case it has been. Uh, has been failed and then I have to address it in order to uh, address it I have to send the message to uh, a tester and ask him okay this is happening and then he should fix it and uh, the, another thing it could be a compilation issue it could be uh, anything related to code then I have to address it uh, by telling the developer by sending him a mail or something or telling him directly okay this needs to be addressed and then fix it so that's uh, something that we do okay so uh, the third thing that I do is, and this is the most important thing to me, that I create uh, uh, create a structure in which I write everything down in in a diary or in a or on a piece of paper, what I have to do on a daily basis uh, on on that day. For example, today is uh, 14th of June, so I'll uh, I'll write a date 14th of June, and after that I'll write all the topics that I have to do today. I still have uh, a notebook in front of me. In this, I write everything down uh, by red ink. I write. Uh, the daily uh, stuff that I have, uh, the date, and then in the blue that I have to do, and then I just tick them if if it's done. So uh, everything that happens, uh, this is the most important thing uh, for me. Uh, after that, uh, somewhere around uh, the fourth thing is I take a look at the Jira. So what exactly is Jira? Jira is an Atlassian tool. Uh, this tool is needed uh, for uh, law. Uh, writing all those to user stories and tasks and epics which a product owner or a product manager assigns you so if our us team is assigning some uh, something something to me uh, that i'll go and check over there and depending on the importance i will assign it to myself or I give it to someone or will pick it up so there are two things that i generally take care uh, then i take a look at is priority and severity so these two are uh, different thing, uh, two different things, and severity is the uh, degree of impact that uh, that a defect on the development 
or operation of a team component or a system uh, severity is kind of a this and priority is the level of uh, importance it addresses to the business uh, for example a defect or something so based on that uh, we take a decision and i take up the task and uh, uh, plan my day accordingly okay uh, after that uh, somewhere around uh, one o'clock or uh, two o'clock i take my lunch uh, that's not related to what i do as a devops engineer but i have to eat to keep going so the fifth thing that i do is uh, this the lunch the, the lunch part only and the sixth thing that i pick uh, for the day is uh, i start my uh, daily work after that uh, and this is the most crucial time that i have because uh, in this generally i don't take any kind of meetings i don't accept meetings uh, unless uh, there is something really important that needs to be addressed and if some junior of mine or some senior of mine uh, for example uh, if some junior needs some help from my my end so i have to address it and i then i help him or her or them so that's what i do and if i need some kind of help i have to uh, call my uh, senior some uh, manager or someone to uh, ask like what i need to do next and i mean uh, i do not uh, take a major break in this uh, in this time period my 5 to 10 minutes is fine for a quick coffee or something i kind of complete my work till 6:30 or 7 and send the mail and the status is done so this is something that i uh, do daily uh on a, on a daily basis uh, as a routine uh, as a devops engineer uh when i close my laptop 6:30 to 7 then the real work start for me and this is something that i do on my personal basis uh this is a time period which uh, i help uh, myself uh, uh, to to learn something and my personal learning includes uh, i pick a topic to study uh sometimes i pick a python program try to uh, write a python program sometimes a smaller one sometimes a bigger one and uh, uh, sometimes uh, i pick a topic and read there are multiple wi- white papers available over the internet uh, from aws from azure and sometimes i do a poc for myself for my learning and if i find it very interesting then i share it with you and create a video on it and uh, i'm a part of a, a group uh, in my org- organization in which uh, i do some kind of pocs and write white papers for them like personally for uh, my organization that's uh, one thing that i do sometimes i write a script for my next video sometimes i study uh, if there is anything interesting that uh, i need to teach uh, that what i do and after that uh, everything is done uh, if everything is done i cannot create videos every on a daily basis because i have a full time job and uh, i give my close to 8 to 9 hours to this job sometimes more if the if the client is in the us and have different time zones then i have to take call uh, late at night but i don't go beyond 12 o'clock i call it a day at uh, 12 o'clock and after that uh, i go outside for a jogging a bit of gymming or sometimes uh, i play badminton uh, to to uh, pass a bit of my time and then uh, i call it a day after uh, 11 11 11:30 and i go to bed uh, somewhere around uh, 12 and then i sleep and if i am not able to tick everything which i created uh, which i have wrote down on a piece of paper on my diary uh, then i take as the first thing in the morning so that's uh, what i do So yeah this is a fair idea of what I do on a general basis as a devops engineer uh, my daily routine uh if you like the video please share uh, and like and subscribe the video because that's what uh, that is important for me uh, anyway uh, do drop your comments uh, in the comment section if there is anything specific uh, that you want me to address or and you want me to talk about and uh, yeah this is all about so thanks guys and i'll see you in the next one